dropped all season, uh, albeit away from home against the Brisbane Raw side. As Bozza mentioned, that certainly has changed their tactics in the second half. They did to Sydney what Sydney did to them in the first half. Yeah. They continued to, they started to press them high, and through that high press, they were able to get uh, a few opportunities go their way. But these are the, the, this is the first goal, super strike oh. by uh, Brilliante after wonderful lead up work by Brosk in terms of uh, his harassing and, and winning the ball back off the Brisbane defence. Uh, and they continue to, to have chance after the chance in that first half. Not much. Theo or any goalkeeper could have done with that uh, with that strike, was mm. it? Oh, absolutely outstanding strike. I'd, I'd love to have the speed going and to see how quick that actually went past. But um, and Brisbane come back into it. Uh, unbelievable strike as well uh, in a different type of way. Not so much power, but wonderful precision outside the boot uh, from Christensen, um, basically right before half time. Really, uh, in a game that they should have probably should, at this stage should have been three 0 down. So as I was talking about, wonderful fighting spirit. Yes, it's, it is a little bit easy to do. Oh, well, this well, is the this Graham exactly, Pohl moment yes, for the yes. A-League, but no. Yes. This is the vision in its entirety of when we thought Ryan Grant was getting his first yellow card. Alan Milliner has gone from right hand to left hand, and he's thinking about things. He's telling everyone to go away. He's taking his time. He hasn't issued the card yet. And whoop! Into the pocket it goes. And that's what everybody missed. Yeah. The fact mm. that he put it into his pocket. Mm. And um, look, we, we spoke about it. Um, I guess everybody's sitting at home. We're up in arms and, and asking the same sort of question. Surely the, the second...